All right, let's jump back into it, across this stupid swamp, this stupid river. Go fight some stupid bandits. They're probably gonna suck. Hopefully we can get there in time though to see what it is we're up against. There we are, just a poacher, mini. Oh, that's actually not that bad. Especially for 670. I feel like, I'm gonna be suspicious. Your soul's already gone. Yeah, that's fine. I wasn't really using it anyway, so you know. Just a poacher, though, is really not that threatening. Watch now, he's gonna shoot somebody ahead and kill him. We have to fight him in the woods, but we have more range, so they should have to come to us. And we actually have pretty good vision of them, too. Let's see what they do. Uh, he's gonna dance around. These people are gonna slowly march up. They're gonna try to favor these spots up here. Which is fine, let them. It's not going to make a difference. It's not going to save them. Bam! Nailed him. Absolutely destroyed his armor right off the bat. Brilliant, I say. Let's go ahead and put the walls up. Still going to favor this spot right here. That's fine. We're going to keep you there. Got a pitchfork. Excited to start playing some raiders. Simply because, probably. Uh, I think the last time we played on stream wasn't quite that long ago, but that's been a bit since we played it. I love this game. Um, I want to start seeing some raiders. Uh, not that we're really ready to fight them, but they're gonna start having some of the newer weapons. I think. Really, really super excited to see. Let's jump you up here. That's better ground, and it should really dissuade them. Your spear wall should do you quite well there, I think. Can't go there. Oh, we can't go there. Okay, cool. Everyone here has like a shield. I'm kind of impressed by that. Alright, it's worth an effort. Gonna move up here and take a shot from back there. Okay. He's aiming for Hillhom, or uh, I keep wanting to call him Hillhom. What's your name? Hadebrand? Who's aiming for Hadebrand? Because it doesn't have a shield. Interesting. You guys don't seem to know what you're doing. Ah, it looked like that second one was going to hit him. Ah, uh, you're trying to get up there. What do you think about that? Now there's nowhere to get up on. Is there? Not a total war. It's hard because now strategy games, you know, back in the day it used to just be a strategy game is a strategy game. You'd either have a turn based, which kind of what they were at the time. They Some people consider it the golden age for turn based games back in like the early 90s. Um, and I can understand why. Uh, but you either had that or you had like a real time strategy, and that was pretty much it, right? You either had like Command and Conquer. Or, you know, something to that sort it wasn't really that different. Might as well just be the same game, but skinned differently. Exactly. Those three were the first ones that came to mind. Or you had a turn-based one, like, uh, you know, like one of the original Fallouts. And there, that was that was more or less it, right? Now strategy games are so many different types, and there's so much difference between even the same type in there. Uh, oh, yeah, the, the original XCOM for PC. The original XCOM. Are quite murderous. I think you're okay to stay there. So now to be like, I like strategy games. I feel like it's it's kind of almost a bland statement. You know, you really almost have to specifically say which ones it is you enjoy to really kind of convey what it is you mean by that. Get him. F up his day. Brilliant work. I know, right? And they got worse the more you like, the more they came out. The later ones, just, just terrible. But I loved it, man. When I was like 12, playing those games, they were, they were awesome. I think they were what made me like fall in love with PC gaming. The original Command and Conquers. Can we up this guy, stay up? Do it. Brilliant! Right in the leg. Is that the arm? Nope, leg. I'll show him. 
They probably won't. That will show them, though. That one definitely sent a message. He's still kind of groaning about it. Absolutely brilliant. Hit him. Come on. Are you even trying to kill anybody? I feel like that's a very solid no. I'm probably going to move him down there. Yes, wreck him. It's because I don't like that spot being open. It's going to be really easy for someone to get between those spear walls, I think. And not much is going to happen up here. Yeah, I looked. Oh, yeah. They were awesome. They really were. Uh, I think I want to bring you down here, even though it puts you in his face. And you don't have the ability to attack for some stupid reason. Let's wait on you. Let's do that too. Let's see what happens. I try to jump through? No, you just shift up and sit there. Excellent. That's what I was hoping to see. I was thinking about moving him up, and that's why I didn't. You guys can go ahead and rest. You've done a good job. There's going to be a lot more fighting this turn, I think. Could move you up. I'm up on you. He's finally coming into uh, play here. Ah, uh, you missed a 73. That's, that's not good to see. And you really paid the price for it. Almost as much as this guy is. Nicely done. Had yeah, that shield up, didn't stop you from, from getting him. Hit him. Hit him. Embarrassing. 61. Get him. Nice. That is an arm shot. That will definitely affect his chances of hitting us back. way -o. That's not good. Let's see what you have to say about that. I'm going to jump back in there. Screw you. I don't have the energy to do anything. So you really did kind of nullify him for that turn, which sucks. guy is really feeling it here. You can't stand there. You can only stand right there. That's actually quite interesting. Let's get down here. I think we just killed him. Yep, there it is. He did take note of it too. He was like, ah, crap, that was my friend. Killed him, you monster. I did. That has happened. Probably 40% chance to hit him. If I hit him, it's a 75% chance to stun him. I say let's go for it. Nah, uh, that sucks. Mmm, yeah, that really sucks. Stab him right in the head, good job. Could have stabbed him again, I should have. I don't know what this guy's doing with his life. You have your shield up. You do not. So, suck it and die. There you go. You're getting into this fight more. Very interesting. He wants to run. Great news for us. Try your best. That's okay. You're hiding behind the damn trees now. Of course you are. 43% chance is your best shot you had. You break that spear wall? You're gonna try. We stabbed you in the neck for it. There is a lesson there to be had. God, I hope you die. You too. Sorry. Shield up. You really need to start dodging some of those attacks. That's gonna be important for you. Can I not stand there? Oh my god, that's terrible. It's absolutely terrible. Who wants to run? Good. Positioning. Oh my god, this is, I hate forests, man. They're so terrible to try to walk through. I understand that's the point. But it's just awful. It really is. It's 51. 58. It's really not much better. See, I mean, for a 7% difference, we might as well try to hit the guy that is more of a threat. And uh, we got something for it. Excellent work. Excellent work. 
go ahead and try to move you up. Let's go ahead and see if we can finish this guy off. I'd like to get him out of the way. So people can go up and catch him before he gets away. But, uh, we might not be able to catch him. Because forced. Because forced. Well, we can snag him here at least. He might still slip well. It's hard to say what might happen. Let me try. Nicely done. Nicely done. That that's enough to get somebody excited. We still might not be able to catch the same guy. Luckily, he's not fleeing, so he won't try to slip out. He will stand there and try to fight us, which uh, will not work out well for him. That guy is actually much closer than I realized. No, no, no. We're going to kill him. He's got a nice spell. He's got to die. Let's wait on you. Uh, Sure. He goes, switches weapons, trying to stab me. Did not work. Got terrible aim, but we hit him, and now he wants to flee. Let's just wait on you. There's absolutely no music playing right now, and it's kind of, kind of terrible. Ten minutes, I'll take it. Stab him. There we go. Finally, we can get out of this terrible, terrible force. Got two levels for it. I'll take it. Some bread, some money. Excellent. Some armors. Tools and the such. All great things to run into. Am I not entertained? My busy store was able to carry tasty Quebec maple whiskey. Ooh. Another prisoner we found. Wow. Yeah, might as well come with us. Uh, let's see what you are all about, sir. Let's see. This is him here. He is a farmer with sure footing and he's a survivor. Now this guy could be bringing some to the table. The only problem I have with him is that he doesn't have a star in his melee. Otherwise, he would be quite considerably great. Uh, but he is set up to be a decent tank. As for now, I'm not really in love with him, but he's free, so I'll take it. Hey, Firewolf, how are you, friend? Thanks for coming by. It's good to see everyone. It really, really is. So what do you have here? Plus three when you don't have a star in this skill. That is nice stuff. We'd we'll like to get you some more health, but honestly, you're going to roll well on your health every time. So I'm not going to get too excited about that. Rotation! Hello. Now we can try to start saving some lives. Um, God, you're not very great either. Ugh. You're really not that great. This will make you considerably better, but not great. Still not great. However, no, we don't have any arrows. We'll have to buy some and see if we can put some on them so we can give them a bow. Um, that would be nice. For one, it gives us another range, dude, right? It does. But two... He actually has a decent chance to hit now. Unlike before, it was just abysmal. Now it's possible that it might happen. We were bringing up Eva again. I'm doing well, friend. Thank you for asking. I'm glad your days are past us. They'll never be past you for some people. Uh, cleared the Amber Street routes. Do not sell any quivers of arrows for moi. But your jewels are decently priced, and your food is decently priced. So let's buy them. The ammunition is not decently priced, but we kind of really need it, so we're going to buy that too. We we'll probably sell this. We should be able to sell that. What other things do we have that we don't necessarily need on us? We'll keep it. Maybe we don't need you.
militia man for under a grand that's armored. That's not necessarily bad. Butchers, I've had really good luck with butchers in the past. Some of my late game people have been butchers. Even after they had somebody rip out their eye, which did happen. They were still really great. I'm not really lacking on melee people right now. So I'm gonna pass. Unfortunately this place doesn't have another job for us either. Any good rumors for me? No. Wait. Who was? Look. Have. Okay. That place. Pretty sure there should be another, like, letter in there, but whatever. I'm not gonna tell you how to live your life. Oh, it's where we're going next, anyways. Perfect. That's great news. Uh, it's nice to have some food and money. <laughs> I'll tell you. You never know how much you take those things for granted until you are about to starve or, you know, get turned on because you're not paying people. Get there during the day, that'd be great. Uh, we should have a little issue with that. They sell amber here, it's most likely gonna be expensive. Ah, but you have a level one contract, which might be all we really want right now from life. Yeah, that's stupid expensive. <laughs> you guys have hilarious. Um, do you have a quiver of arrows? You do. I'm gonna buy them. Because we do need one, your nets are a little expensive, but I would really like to get one. We can afford it now. That's what these people back here with the javelins are really supposed to be doing. And by people with the javelins, I guess I only have one set. Problem is, is I can't do this setup then. It's gotta be either or. And honestly, I think it'd rather be this. Which means I didn't need to buy those arrows, because this guy now has these. Which makes me feel a little stupid, but that's okay. Um, but, we could do this. Now, I know what you're thinking. Sort of, his range skill is putrid. Literally putrid. Yes. Yes, you're correct. However, he just sits here and waits for somebody to come up and attack. And he's not doing a damn thing. So while the skill and chance to hit somebody with an arrow is low, it's still higher than zero. So that's something. Also, it does give us another ranged character to, to count against their number of ranged characters, which is how they determine who's going to be rushing who. So it's a win-win. Make, there will be names in the You guys see somebody in here you want named. Just shout it out, man. I'm happy to do it. Food here is expensive. Things here are expensive. Let's see if we can help that out by doing a job or two. You want me to go on a caravan. You need to be paid more. It must be close by because it's not much money. Escort. About a day to the northeast. To Bola. I think that's just straight north of us, to be perfectly honest. We'll do it after we do this job. What do you have here? Something is terrorizing you. You hired the famed Sorthio, Sir Theo, to go out there and hunt down something or another. He did not return. Now you're asking me. Give me money up front. Get some money. Okay. Who knows what might be up against here, though? Add no one. Alright. We got some good people, actually. Like this guy. It'll be easier to remember if his name is no one. He's one of the starting brothers, too, so he is a rarity. Am I spelling that right? I am. Noland, the Berserker. It's easy to remember people's names when you name them. That's part of the reason I do it. Oh, a brawler. Yeah, done. Come. I will almost, almost always hire a brawler when I see one. He's a night owl. He's a Spartan, but most importantly, he's got two stars in fatigue and two stars in melee, and his base skill is 55. That makes him rather good. Not better than Hill Home. But better than some of the people we have around. Like you. You're not particularly great, Roderick. Um, your health is good. There's other things about you that I enjoy. Gravedigger is not super fantastic either, to be perfectly honest. 
So let's take you out. We'll put him in. Let's uh, strip you down a bit. But can we give you a shield, a helmet, uh, better armor? Yes, these things all sound reasonable so far. What weapon best describes you? Uh, I don't like this. It doesn't do a very good job hitting. The sword is a better weapon. Especially that sword. It's a pretty nice sword. I'd rather give you a spear, spear but that works out. The greatest cripple. You know what? Screw it. This guy, he's alright. He's actually he's actually pretty good. I'm gonna do you a favor and name him Mikiyagi. We're gonna break the cycle. The cycle of shame. He'll probably get one shot in here in the next battle. Only renewing the cycle of shame, but until that happens, you can say I tried. Because I am trying. This is it. This guy is huge and dumb. You know what? I'll name him Serdum. <laughs> I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna stricken anybody else with that. Who else? Who else do we have? That's pretty awesome. This guy's pretty good. Leonard. He actually is pretty good, especially for being a monk of all things. So we're naming Firewall. And I think that just leaves Jess. Usually. Who else? Who else is here that might need a name? Hooray, McYucky. Dwarf Apple is here, but I think he might be AFK. I haven't seen him talking a bit. Dwarf Apple does need a good name. I don't know if I have anybody that great. Though. That needs naming. You're okay. I just like the name Wolfram. So much that I probably won't replace his name. I just I just enjoy the name Wolfram a lot. Anyways, that's enough fooling around. Um, we came here to hunt down something and murder it, such a such a. Ah, uh, well, good luck with that, all. Kids, they uh, they seem stressful. They were pretty good here. All right, let's head out. We can hunt down that thing. Hopefully it's not too, uh, too terrifying, whatever it is. What is this now? A new event? Oh my god. Garden Lover is now following. Thanks, Garden, for coming by and following. I really appreciate that. And this is a new event I've never seen before, too. Walking around town with a few cell zones, you turn a corner to find an opulent man surrounded by thieves and bandits. They look over their shoulders and widen their eyes. One nicks the merchant on the cheek. All right, we'll get you next time, you bastard. Scoundrels quickly make off. A moment later, the merchant, heavily armed guards appear. Nursing his wound, he starts yelling at them. What am I paying you sorry bastards for? The second I get into trouble, you're nowhere to be seen. Look at this man here. That's the one I should be paying. Here, take this for your troubles. Throws me something for my troubles. 25 crowns, just for doing nothing. I like it. I like it. For those who aren't a will, Garden is a home's mother. Always comes by his streams. Plays a couple games with him. See sometimes on stream. Good time. Oh, that's alright. Appreciate you coming by and saying hi. Along the way, we see uh, notices of the beasts at hand. Hopefully, whatever it is, we don't have to fight them in the swamp. They see us, they're coming. Die wolves. I'll take them, especially if it's not in the swamp. I think we're ready. I think we're about as ready as we're going to be. Let's do it. Let's fight him. Well, that's a quick start. Uh, you're not frenzied, are you? I'm always worried about that. They're not. Alright, what is your rage skill? It is... It's alright. There we go. I think you're the one that has the terrible range skill. Yeah. We'll take one shot. Nail it, which is excellent. Switch back out. So you can be ready. Nailed him. Good, he wants to go. Uh, too bad. So sad, it won't be happening. Let's try to cut him off a bit. I should keep him from wanting to fight me. Put that up. Excellent. 
Oh, that's a little disappointing, not gonna lie. Okay. No one there with the big stick. Okay, we missed. I'm actually gonna put your shield up, because I expect you to get surrounded. Or at least you're gonna be attacked three times. Brilliant. Brilliant. Alright, let's move in. Poke him in the face, would you? Excellent. Wasn't the face, but I'll take it. Ah, very nice. Very nice indeed. Move down. Take a shot. Nothing. Good. We're breaking him a bit. I don't know how you missed that, Wolfram. Really don't know how you how you did that. That was absurd him. Big and stupid. And manages to scare the thing to death. Excellent. Okay. Good start so far. Yagi, get in there with your sword. Cut him up. Very nice. So two of them want to flee. This guy we still need to concern ourselves with. It's Nolan. This is a Steam game. It is. Yeah, you should totally buy it. Honestly, this game is so good. You really, really, really should buy it. Uh, and it's on sale for a bit too. The base game is. Uh, I don't know necessarily what for, but honestly, it's it's not expensive. It is so good. I have over 400 hours in this game, and that's just with the base game. Only now do I have the DLC that honestly, just, of course, just came out. But it's so good. You should buy it. It's so brutal too. Right, I'm not gonna shield up now because he has more than one person to attack. So it's not going to be as great as an idea as it was before. You're dead. Really? I can't move to... You take 6 AP? Really? I was not aware of that. Um, We're going to move you down there just to kind of break him and get another person surrounding them. That will help us land other shots. Oh, good. He is broken too. Now's your time to shine, Wolfum. Okay, or it's not. Firewolf with kill. Surround this guy. Put him down, put him down. You can do it. Yagi. Swooping around trying to get in there. And he'll help here. Knowing how to do it. So much for being crippled. There's three level ups. There we go. And just one wolf pelt, but that's all we needed to be able to finish what we're doing. And we actually got some strange meat, which is really cool. We never used to get those from wolves. And it totally makes sense that we do. Let's be done with this. We have crowns to collect. Boy, do we. No longer suffering from disappearing villagers. Uh, you know what? Before we hop into town, let's pause it and not do that. Bola. Cool. That is the town we want to go to next. So it makes all the sense that we take this job. Let's go to Caravan. Uh, let's see here first. These prices are better. Uh, though we're kind of okay in tools. They're going to feed us on the way up there. These are kind of expensive. We don't necessarily need them right now. So honestly, I think we're going to pass on this. I don't see anything that great. The net's a better price. Let's buy the net. You can't find those in every town. Any good rumors for me? Every company, da, 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 so they collected the ears of their enemies going around their necks. Good for them. Let's take this job and go. Let's do it. We have magically turned into a caravan with a donkey and a corn. Let's see, I won't be terribly upset if we get attacked, just because I wouldn't mind a fight. We get paid either way, so... You know, there's always that... But if we get attacked by anything, it's most likely going to be humans. Which means stuff we can sell. But, alas, it does not happen. And this place is well supplied. It is a great buff for the town. It means they'll have more products than they normally would a two-handed wooden hammer. Less than 500. Here's that two-handed spear I was talking about too for the back line. Cheap. Oh, your berries are cheap. Alright, let's sell the strange meat. It's not really good. It's not really good to have. Um, I've never had it happen, but I think there's a chance that it can make people sick. I don't care for that. The tools are cheap. 
These are about 50 crowns cheaper too. So let's stock up on some of this stuff. Now is the time. Now is the time. They have some decent armors too. God, there's there's things to get here. Uh, people? Good people to get? Mm, not really. This guy could be pretty good, especially since he's got the title Lucky. Orc Bane could be interesting too. I'm kind of curious just to see if there's a trait that goes with Lucky. Sometimes there are. But we really don't need somebody. And I'm not that curious, I guess. This is super, 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 super awesome. But I honestly don't know what need we would have for it. We don't run into too many heavily armored people, and if we do, I don't really want to destroy their armor. I want to take it from their dead body and wear it. Which you can't do if you destroy it. It's not the public school mystery me. Ah, there you did it anyways. It's good for the kids. But I think I might buy this. I don't know. Or these. I probably shouldn't buy both. Alright, I'm gonna hold off on the... Spedum? I'm gonna probably call it Septum. Because I'm dumb. I'm gonna hold off on it because if we do this job and come back, there's a good chance that it will be slightly decreasing price because the town won't like us more. So that's what we're going to aim for. Also, we'll have more use out of the javelins, I think. You're up there. Firewolf is coming to his own. We'll get rotation. It's good to see. Hopefully we'll get more people with rotation here soon. Hill home. More skill ups. Absolutely fantastic to see. He's a shining star. Look at that plus four. God, that's so good. It's so good. We're gonna grab this even though he doesn't really need it. Not like others do. See, you know, it's only max three. I'm gonna take it. It's good stuff. Plus four is a good roll to have. He really does kind of need some resolve too. Especially being on the end. And health. But we're gonna get that. I don't like somebody being under 70 fatigue. Like free fatigue. So, we're gonna get that. You're the one with crap aim. And I'm probably gonna put you in the front line at some point. Because you're actually not turning out to be that bad. Problem is, is your plus two is just terrible. I don't know. You could be a flag person, though, to be honest. Uh, banner holder. I keep raising that, so that doesn't make a lot of sense. I'll give you rotation with plans of putting in the front, I think. And for the throwing spears. You know what, let's take you this off you. Because I think I want to give you these. Which means I can't. Yeah, I can. I can keep that up. I just can't give you a net. Which we did. Buy one. So let's take this off. We'll give you the net. It's one equip. You can switch out. I like that idea better. But you can have all your pockets full if you're going to do that. Just because you put this on and then you need two spaces, you only have one. I don't. The game, I imagine, just wouldn't let you do that. So this is better. Let's uh, flip out some of these helmets and stuff. You haven't know, rotated through our equipment very well. Um, yeah, I guess you're better, technically. All oh, the armor is caught up. I rotated through a bit better. There we go. Exploded. A pod of lost spawned right next to a ranger. Should have played storm half the pod. Nice. See, I don't usually go blade sword, but it is good stuff. That's one of the things I like about um, War of the Chosen. It really does bring out the need for different builds that I normally wouldn't do, but they are much better. Except for the pistol build. Pistol build is even more OP than War of the Chosen. It's so good. Alright, fair enough. I think that's 
all the fooling around that we need to do. Giggity. I think we need all these hoods. We certainly don't need all these pitchforks. Keep one. Uh, I'm pretty happy with that. So let's do it. I will probably be coming back for you. Let's take a look at this job. We don't even know what it is. You want me to go and discover an area. See the dark spot here. Go and try to find an abandoned cemetery somewhere in the region of Ridland. Quite price, we'll find it. 300 crowns. 330 it is. Far away to the south. This could be interesting. We could make this happen. Where is Ridland? Hopefully it's not too far. The other place was stupid far away. I like that this is a thing. It's Markland. Splintered something. Wolf something. Ridland looks like it is right here. You can't really see it. As soon as you zoom in, the fog kind of covers up more, but it looks like it says Ridland right there. Can confirm, says Ridland. So that's a, that's a bit of a trip, especially for 300. But you know what? I've never done one of these before, so... Ah, no, don't do that. We're going to do it anyways. Let's go back in there and tell him, yes, yes, we will. Let's pick up a little bit more food. Eight days, seven days. Just so we don't starve. This is actually pretty cheap, too. And it would make people happy. This is half the price, so we're going to go with that. Sorry, friends. No happiness for you. Alright, let's get out there and say hello. Make some friends. Do some good in the world. And it doesn't tell us exactly where it is. We have to legitimately go find it ourselves, which is kind of cool. Oh, did you end up trying tofu? It really is good. Don't listen to Firewolf. The real question is, what are you trying to make with it, I think? I'm no tofu expert. You have there's surely better people to ask. But um, the things I make with it, I am very happy with. Ah, uh, God. You know what? It's probably faster for you to go. I'll just let you decide how we're going to get there. Uh, if you... What I recommend is, is making it out of something for something like uh, to replace ground meat. Then it typically can go really well. If you were to do that... Oh, we already found it! Well, it's already time to return. The guild master. It was easier to find than you figured. Marketing on your map, you pause and chuckle and shake your head. What luck. It is. We found it. We don't have to clear it. We just have to find it. Interesting. I'm hesitant to go clear it because I don't necessarily know what's in it. But you know what? We're already here. It kind of feels like a waste. The thing about cemeteries is you just don't know what you're getting yourself into. Uh, but real quickly to finish my thought on the tofu. Um, buy it firm. Press it if you can. There's tofu presses you can get. If not, you can put like two pans together and kind of press it. Uh, that really helps get a lot of the extra moisture out. Crumble it. Fry it in a pan. Really fry it for a while. 20 minutes, maybe? 15, 20 minutes. Put some oils, whatever seasoning you want to put in it. Like if you're going to put it in chili, per se. Um, and just really kind of let it dry up a bit. And it can take a while for it to dry up. And then throw it into your chili with whatever seasonings you like. Bam. It, uh, it is really good. Can't make out who we're going to fight. Oh, God, I hope it's not those things. Look how big that thing is. Oh, good, it's just these guys. I wonder if I get a bonus for clearing it. I wonder if he gets mad at me for clearing it. So, these things aren't to be underestimated. You have to be very, very careful about how you go about killing them. But we're not killing them at all if you're like me. Great. Yeah, I didn't expect you to hit it, so that's, that's fine. Nail him. There we go. Right, you just chill out there, Nolan. We might have to net one of these big guys, so they don't go crazy on us. It's hard to say what they'll do. Hopefully they will... Sp oh, come on, really? Hoping to inflict a lot of damage on them. Well, let this kind of break up their attacks as best we can. Very good. 
Nice work, nice work. That's not so great. But we can manage with that. Excellent kill there. Now we have to deal with that body though. Let's go ahead. Wait on you. Let's see if we can stab it. Excellent. Very good work. We might have to stuff on that guy too. Nice shot on him. He will be regretting that decision later. What was the decision? I don't know, but he's going to regret it. That much, I do know. Good, he's dead. We have to stand on their dead bodies. You can't just let them be. They will eat them, they will get stronger. You must, you must do it. No one wants to, it's just what it is. And you have to kind of encroach them like that. Keep that out. We're gonna wait. Same with you. Okay. He wants to run. It's cute. Let's get quite surrounded. Very good work, very good work. Spear walls are the way to go with these people. These people. Oh, that is... Nice. Should have put shields up. Shoulda, woulda, coulda. Alright, let's get you out of here. You're not doing anybody any good. And let's just wait with you. Step on that body. Okay, they're all pretty much fitting now, which is really great to see. Especially the ones surrounding this guy. Who's in trouble. Ah, that's... that's Shapoopy. Quickly make him work him. Good, good, good. I don't want you to get anywhere, so I'm gonna stand behind you. Stand behind you. Guard up, so we know you're gonna go for him. We know it. Brilliant. That round went much better for us. Uh, until you, I mean, at least in my area, it is kind of kind of cheap comparatively. On brown, I imagine has a much better recipes for this stuff than I do. Undoubtedly. Just random emails. Okay. Let's step up here and murder this thing. Brilliant. Let's wait. I want to see just who can we get up here. Good poke. Right in the face. Thank you. Move you down a bit so others can get in the range of him. Like this gentleman here. He missed. And... Ew, not you. Uh, cool, we killed him. That was a little bit easier than I thought it would be. Uh, not gonna lie. You can't do anything, though. Not yet. You can. Good job. Oh, no. I don't think we're gonna really get anything for clearing it. But we did get some levels, four levels. Oh. Hello. We got some... Noxair horns. Two Noxair brains. What could you possibly want with this? It's <laughs> awesome. Horns to turn into trophies. A fair amount of gold. And the silver bowl. Which is quite nice. Quite nice. So, yeah, we actually did get some good stuff out of that. Yeah, drying it up helps out, especially if you want to use it to like replace ground meat. Once you can get that down, it really makes a big difference. Oh, your fatigue is still just not that great, though. Welcome to level two, though. I'm sure, it will treat you better than some people, probably. I don't feel like I should lie to him. 
Interpretation, quite nice. Rollo. Um, may or may not be going places in life. I am yet to decide. You definitely need to get gifted. I mean, it's a requirement pretty much for everyone, but that will be quite a help to you. Do you not have anything thrown for you? I mean, your range is kind of good. I mean, your melee is kind of good. Excuse me. If we keep that getting up higher, we could make you a hybrid frontliner as well. For now, let's give you that. I wouldn't mind getting you spears and some netting to throw, to be perfectly honest, but it's not super high on my list since we already have a couple of people that do that. But that's okay. Mr. Merciless here. Let's see what you can do for us. Still have high hopes of putting you in the front line. I mean, good god. You are definitely bringing things to the table. Now the real question is here, what do I want to do with your last? I'm going to put you in the front line, giving you some melee defense. Makes a lot of sense. Getting you some more fatigue. Makes you a lot of sense. As does getting you some resolve. Your resolve isn't terrible though, to be perfectly honest. So why don't we do that, I guess. And... Rotation. God, rotation is just so good. There will be a time when we very much, very much want to use it. How much is that bowl worth? You know what? It's fine. I guess it doesn't really matter. Because we'll probably come back down here next and uh, sell it there, would be my guess. Mmm, coffee. I don't care if it is kind of gold and quite old. But it is. Still good. So that's quite interesting. And it really did seem to give us a location that was kind of par to our level, even though it wasn't marked as a quest after we found it. We were quite lucky to find it right away, though. I didn't realize kind of how big it constituted this area. I mean, it said Rinland over here, and it was way over there. So we didn't really find it. Otherwise, it could have been quite the struggle had I gone in the other way. Let's see here. You come to him. With a fresh map in hand. He takes a look at it and looks at you. Well then, I'd mind to think this spot was too easy. But an agreement is agreement, and he gives us the money he owes us. Fantastic. Do you like me slightly better in a town? Yes, you do. This price did drop slightly. It's now 666. Weird, but okay. Uh, you can pretty much trade this for that. If we go to the right spot. I really do want the spear. Just because I have never had one before. Kind of same thing with the Samer, to be perfectly honest. Uh, that being said... Oh wait, those things are cheap. It's 80 armor, right? It's a 15 increase, which is a fair amount for some people here. Not so much you, but two wouldn't be so bad. I don't know if I really should spend a couple hundred on it, though. We're not that rich. Hmm. Hmm. We'll buy the last of the bears. Ugh, I really shouldn't buy that. I don't have enough money to buy that. We will once we sell this thing, but that's not right now. If I was going to buy something, I really should be buying the armor. It's what Smarter Absurdum is saying to himself, even though it's not new stuff, which I really want to mess around with. I do. We can rotate these through to some people that really deserve it. Like... Yeah, you're pretty good. Yeah, yeah, that's a tad bit better. Actually, you know what? Really, you should be... No, stop that. I clicked on him. There we go. And do it like that, I think. That's a bit better. Alright, enough small talk. Let's get on to the killing, right? Should be killing pigs. 